Welcome back to Dark Souls 3. Got my big old greatsword imbued with chaos. And we're gonna go visit a garden. I like this garden. Oh, that's right. <laughs> There's always that period of time where I'm relearning the buttons. I don't think rapport works on you. I think I'm out of mana. Whoa! Excuse me, sir. I just want to see if rapport works on you. Holy shit, it does. Whoops. Oh, what happened? Oh, come now. There we go. God, I love rapport. Nothing like brainwashing the undead. Uh oh. Goodbye, red guy. Alright, down into the garden. But of course, this is a Dark Souls game, or an on elevator, so... Always gotta keep your eyes open for places to jump off the elevator prematurely. It's a sacred rite of passage on elevators. Estes Shard! Although, what I really want... is some good old bone dust. Sublime bone shards. All right. As you can see, we got some big boys. Very large boys. Oh, uh, that's right. I'm using a dark flame. My sword, meanwhile, a regular type. Whoops, toxic shit. Ah, oh, boy. Toxic is so annoying. Alright, I should take advantage of my toxic state. Get the last things that I need to get that are in the poison water. Makes a weird noise. Let's have a sip. I know there's something in the poison. Here we go. Really, there's a lot of things in the poison, but... I meant right over here. You know, here's a question. Do I even have a means of getting rid of Toxic right now? No, I don't. Of course I don't. Just makes this more fun! Oh, hey, buddy. Listen, can we... Can we talk? Ow! You bastard. Oh, my God. Here, here. Rapport. For when you don't feel like actually fighting dudes. Now here's a question, will it work on the Puss of Man dudes? I don't think it will. Boy, does Toxic last a long goddamn time. Whoa, that's right! I'm part of the Blades of the Dark Moon! All right, off we go. This is probably not a ring I want to be wearing right now. And by ring, I mean covenant thing. Whoops, I think I got summoned into a fight club.
Guess I'll wait my turn. <laughs> Man, all kinds of people are here. Lord Fluffington. Welcome. <laughs> oh, I guess I'll let those two fight. I'll go next. Where can I go? Can it be my turn? All right, let's do this. Now, sadly, I don't have my whip that I'm only ever good at uh, melee combat with that one. Come back here. Oh. I was hoping my charge would stagger. That's all right. You'll see, when I get my whip, I'll be a goddamn murder machine. It untoxic me. Oh, we gotta get out. We gotta get out. Ooh. That was a close one. Alright, I want to see if we can turn a pus of man into a pus of friendship. Holy shit! We can! This changes everything. These guys went from being very scary to not very scary now. Especially when you consider I could become invisible, convince one to fight for me, and just watch two of them fight. Although, if there's just this one... Uh-oh. That's too far away. There we go. <gasps> Protect me! I guess those other guys are too far away. Excuse me, sir! Where were those shamblers? Yeah, what's up, guys? Oh fuck you. God damn it, there's more stuff in there. Get out, get out. Alright, I think I have all of the items that are in the sludge. Yeah, it's not an item, that's a slug. Oh, there's one. Come on. Come on, get out. Oh boy. Whatever, that's fine. Who needs health, right? I don't. Well, might as well take advantage of it, getting all the sludge items. Chunks, that's what I needed. That's good. Right. Uh, this is going to be pretty tight health-wise. It's 
So we're gonna... We're gonna jump out over there pretty soon, but we wanna open a shortcut first. Otherwise... It's gonna be pretty tough getting through... Getting through this boss fight. With no health and no Estus. Alright, everyone. Remain calm. Can't see me. You can only vaguely hear me. I know you're confused. Oh, I wasn't paying attention to my health. Oh my god. So dumb. I was really into the ninja. The way of the ninja. Alright, that's not a problem. That's not a problem at all. Also, I don't think you need to see me backtrack there again. God damn it, I just got back here. Fine, let's defend someone, and then let's take this off. Oh boy, the profane capital. Where's my... my buddy? I think I figured it out. Excuse me. Excuse me. Well, this is a problem I know how to deal with. Oh. Fireballs! Back up! Back on out of here! Hit the road! Is that the invader over there? Looks like the invader. Listen, you guys can stay here nice and safe. Ah, oh, come now. Whatever, I guess I won. I'll keep this on a little bit longer. I like being summoned as a Blade of the Dark Moon. It's fun. Alright. Let's get my goddamn souls first. That's important. Those gentlemen up there are going to die before anyone else does. Whoops! You guys trying to do something with your fucking bell? Alright. Shortcut. Open. Here we are. That's what this door was. Which is very handy. Ah, oh, come on, guy. He'll never know how he died. Titanite scale, always a good one. And here I am. Okay. That's all taken care of. 
Now for another elevator dip. Alright, we're getting off early. Right here. So if you're ever in this area in your own game, you're like, how is that fucking dude on the roof shooting me? Now you know how to get to the dude on the roof who is shooting you. Well, I'm not done up here yet. I have things to do. Such as... Luring both of you over here. Come here. You're going to fight for my amusement. Okay, let's, let's let this happen. There we go. Ah, my guy won! Your prize is death. Good night. Yes, I love making them fight for me. That's an item I missed. Gotta go back. Back for the item. It's important to leave nothing behind. Especially when it's a chunk. My pyromancy flame wants to be upgraded. I don't think there are any invasions in this garden, but just to be safe. Any invasions? NPC invasions? Hey? Alright. What we want to do is go fight the boss. I'm just seeing seeing some sun over there. Here I come. He makes some fun noises. Try rear. All right, rapport is not going to help us. Let's go say hi to the consumed king. There he is. Hanging out with his little baby revolver ocelot. He's invisible. Well, I will not give him up. For he is all that I have. Not here for your baby, dude. Just want to go through those doors behind you. Really all I'm here for. Whoa! Alright. Oh, not good timing. Don't want to be in the Pestle of Mercury. That's bad for me. Dude, you're carrying a baby. Calm down. Baby's invisible. Oh, 
Ah, uh, phase two. A much more frantic phase. Let's get some stamina back. Oh boy. Have a sip. Let's calm down, friend. Oh, come on, what are you over there for? This guy loved dragons too much. Hit him. Oh, got the shield up just in time. Oh, excuse me, excuse me. Oh, I love it when I miss after charging up. God damn it. There we go. Oh, he finally hit me. Have a fireball. Oh, mean. Oh, I'm about to take a bite. Let's get out of that. Take another sip. Yes. Ow. Oh. I'd like to be out of you. Ooh. Calm down. Oh. Sir, sir, I need you to calm down. We can't help you until you help us. Ah! Oh. Sir! Please! Oh, oh no. Get in time? Yeah, there it is. Need to sort my inventory, that way I can get to the... the Avarice Helm in time. Alright. And that was, uh, Osiris, the Consumed King. The man who loved dragons just a little bit too much. Rest at the old bonfire. And... Yeah, take a moment to go uh, turn these into levels. Oh right, we have some coal to give them. Have some profane coal. Where did you happen upon this coal? This is much too dark. I see the abyss in it. Yeah, the smith I remain. I won't turn down your request. I'd like you to DJ for my cousin's uh, birthday party. Your fight. Is for the flame and for your fellow kid. Oh, is it? Just like mine. Is it? You don't know what I'm gonna do. Maybe. I might not even link that fucking flame. Does it not? You know, I, I was thinking. Oh, about yeah. Leaving for another round of thieving. Also, there must be something of use in Lothric Castle. When he gets to this point, I, I'm aware of the danger. Don't let him go. Trap. Not a single man has returned from the castle unscathed, even back in the day. But I don't want to sit around and die a petty rat. And I consider myself your friend. So, if you send him to pillage for Lothric Castle goods, he will not come back. 
You'll have to find his ashes later on, and he can give the ashes to the uh, handmaiden. And then she'll sell his wares. But if you like having Grey right around, refuse. Right, fine. You're very thoughtful, you are. But if you change your mind, do speak up. I meant every word of what I said. I continue a friend who I sell items to at full market value. But he does sell all the best arrows. So there's no way I'm letting him go. Still have plenty of large arrows stocked up. Goodbye. I know what we could do to fill the last few minutes without starting the next area. So, normally we have the green blossom, which temporarily boosts stamina. But if you've been doing the Sirius of the Sunless Realms questline, after you finish the... I think it's just the third Lord of Cinder. Like, when you get teleported, basically. So once you have the dancer fight happen, this will show up. A... a budding green blossom. Of which there's only one in here. We're gonna buy it. Ashen one. And the reason why we did that... You see, one is different. Goodbye, dear grandmother. I will visit grandfather in the Pit of Hollows. That is our way of knowing we have to go back to the Pit of Hollows. Except I do believe it's on the upper portion, so we want to go via... I think this is the quickest one. Let's finish off that Cirrus quest line. That way I could join all the covenants I've been avoiding. Because I know she doesn't hang out with you if you join Rosaria's Fingers. And I think it's also the case if you join... If you join the other one, Aldrich's uh, Faithful. Well, well, the sun has changed because of the Dancer fight. That is a great cue they took from Bloodborne, by the way. Bloodborne being perhaps my favorite game of all time. Is as you go through Bloodborne, it advances the night. And you watch the sky change and the ominous moon becoming redder and redder and getting ever closer. It's just a wonderful way to let you know that your actions and the span of time passing are related. Looks like Cirrus is looking for some help. To fight her grandfather, Hodrick. Hi, Cirrus. I finally found you. Just as I promised, Grandpa. Remember? Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's let's not hurt Cirrus that much. Oh, Hodrick, Jesus. Doing a lot of damage there, Hodrick. Let me show you how damage works. Jeez, you're a healthy boy. Don't let him drink. What did he cast? Ah, oh, I let him drink. Oh, I see. He's healing over time. Oh! Jesus! Whoa! Sirius, heal yourself! He's doing it! You leave her alone. You're a bad grandpa. A bad pa. Oh, uh, all out? One of us will break first. It was me, apparently. Oh, he always knows when to swing. Yes! Oh, get out of there, me!
Goodbye, Hadric. Good night, Grandad. I didn't mean the toast. There we go. All right, the Sears quest is pretty much over. Okay, we're done here, I guess. Let's bone out. Oh, wait, I don't need a bone. Oh, God! Hey, look, an item. Wonder if that has to do with Hodrick. The answer is yes, it's Hodrick's set. Alright, and there's Cirrus again. Let's finish up her quest line. Oh, there you are. I'm afraid I've involved you in my affairs over a little promise at that. My sincerest thanks for your assistance. At last, my grandfather will rest in peace, and I can die. No. But there is one last. May I take a vow to serve you as a knight? Yes! Oh, I am most grateful. I, Cirrus, do hereby serve as your faithful knight. Wherever, whenever I am needed. My loyalty shall never waver. Blessing of the moon upon your journey. Weird that some of her dialogue that was written down was not spoken. Anyway, now Cirrus will be a summonable person for many a boss from this point forward. Uh, and I think... There's some stuff outside near her, her grandfather's grave. Let's go take a quick peek. And then next time when we pick back up, oh my god. Why? I hate this. What kills me too is as you're walking around in here, you can hear the enemies outside. So you know it's loaded. Finally, all right, let's see if we could find the grave of her grandfather, Hodrick. There it is. This is Hodrick's grave. Be a real shame if someone pushed you off. Whoops. All right. Uh, later on, when you finish uh, the the twins up in Upper Lothric, you can come here to find more stuff, because at that point, Sirius will have died. I'm sorry. It makes me sad, too. But now we can do whatever the hell we want, covenant-wise. So, uh, yeah, we'll probably do some of that on another episode, but for now... There it is. Bye-bye. I'll see you next time.